Beauty and the Beast is everywhere. There's a lot of controversy on this doll. They seem to have a lot of stock of those Emma Watson dolls. I wonder why. These could come off? And you can, oh, wow. wow. It's even got, it's got the spike I to hold that. the candle in place. It's actually intended. What do you think about that, Audrey? That's amazing. <laughs> I like it. I seen the I seen the real one too. This is Lumiere when he is cast under the spell. As you can see right there, he has a little face. Wow, beautiful. Limited to two thousand. And they are moving fast. Look at that. This is the actual prop right here. The actual prop in the movie. I guess the put animation over the face in the film to create the talking, talking clock. Hey, Audrey, do you see this one though? Come on. Wow. That's oh, beautiful, wow. That's right? Really nice. Look at that. Oh, that's nicely done. I, I mean, I have no more cabinet space, but. <laughs> <laughs> Look right. what we found. That is cool. So we found this book. Audrey and I, found, Audrey found the book. <laughs> In this uh, merchandise section here, we have the beast, but look what the cast member showed us. Oh, wow. Oh, there he is. And you know what his name is? Anybody here know his name? It's not official for Disney. Uh, Adam. Okay, Adam. that's right. That's it what is I... official now. I did not it's, know. It was official, but it's been cut out of the movie. I it see. didn't make it into okay. the final production, but it's it is it, it is, is official. Wow. I always thought he looked a little funny at the end of the movie. <laughs> did you? You, you? you didn't you didn't love his eyes? Uh, Come on, man. the blue eyes, right? The blue eyes. <laughs> the eyes are nice. <laughs> Did you guys see the new Beauty and the Beast trailer? It's mind-blowing. My dear Belle, you're so ahead of your time. This is a small village. Now, that's my opinion. I know a lot of people are very sensitive to Beauty and the Beast. I grew up with Beauty and the Beast. It's my childhood. And I loved it. It has my approval. saw my old vlog of Hollywood Boulevard Spider-Man, but this one was a little bit more cleaner, a little bit more nicer, gentle, fragile. And look at what we got here. We got, these are actually in the Disney stores. These are the same ones from what I can tell. I love the beast. Something's going on there that I don't know if many people appreciate. Look at this white Disney hat here. This is really cool. I really like this. It's very clean. It's sleek. I may have to pick this up. My head does not work well with hats. A little Mickey emblem. Okay, so usually I go directly to Disneyland at Rope Drop. But today is a different story because today, for the first time ever, we're seeing a 10 minute clip of Disney's Beauty and the Beast coming out next month in March. It's premiering here at Disneyland. I am so excited. I got my 3D glasses. There's not many people here. This is the first showing of the 10 minute sneak peek. I would say there's about 20 people here. Not too many, I thought it was gonna be packed. But the display is beautiful. They're actually the two displays that we've already seen. We have Belle's small town costume, the enchanted rose, and the enchanted mirror. It's as beautiful as I remember it. I'm gonna try to get different angles this time. A lot of you have requested different angles.
as you can see, they have the same backdrop as they had in the theater, which is just incredible because it really makes it look like a complete set from the movie. What's better, these? Or, or these? What's better? Let me know in the descriptions. I don't, I don't think I can save these. I wish I could save these. These are like souvenirs, but many, many people have probably wore these already. It's showtime. This is about to happen right now. Ten minutes of Beauty and the Beast, but I have to say goodbye now, because I can't take you in with me. Here we go. Well, the cameras are turning off. The Showcase Theater, please come on in and grab a seat. At this time, we do ask that you please put away all cameras and video recording. And Deanna? Okay, so they just saw the 10 minute sneak peek. I went to see it three times already. <laughs> so I saw it three times and I was blown away by it. But I don't want to say that to like kind of influence you. I want you to tell me what you guys thought. And be honest. We'll start with what's your name is? Abby. Abby, what do you I think? I thought it was really good. I've seen the old one and this one's pretty good. And let's talk about Emma herself. What do you think? Singing voice. She's a, she has a really It's good great, voice. right? Yeah. I think that was the biggest that's what people were concerned about the most. But that was fantastic. I thought it was really great. Again, I'm kind of influencing your <laughs> decisions. And what do you think here? I really liked it. I'm really excited to see it. Yes. I think so. I think so too. I think uh, the music and that, that that was like more than a sneak peek, don't you think? Yeah. That was like really, the biggest yeah. scenes of the whole thing. Yeah. How about you? I mean, this is this can't be. There has to be somebody who. Has. Oh no, I loved it. You loved yeah. it. I was so. I was, I'm the one that wanted to come. I just saw the preview for Beauty and the Beast 2017, and let me tell you, it was mind-boggling. I got a couple words in my vocabulary. Oh my. Oh. Let's do it again. Oh. My. Oh. I'm being a little uh, <laughs> distracted because we have Daisy coming over. I'm gonna put you right here on this trash can. I wish I could have shown you that sneak peek, but I would have been arrested, most likely. Let's see if we can get this straight. I, I, I honestly, I'm speechless. I didn't believe what I was seeing. I thought it was just gonna be like kind of like a trailer cut, but they showed like three whole scenes and like three songs. If you can see this, if you're in Disney World, if you're close to Disney World, if you're close to Disneyland, I highly recommend seeing it. They actually did even some kind of like effects. I don't know how they did it, but like when a horse went by on screen, they splashed water in your face because the horse went into a puddle. When she went up on the hill, like they turned these fans on in the auditorium and like you were hit with this massive wave of air. Man. High five. No, no, no. No, no reason to be bashful. You guys have knocked it out of the park. <laughs> I'm very excited. My audience is very excited to see it. I'm, this is incredible. Thank you so much. I get a hug? All right, very good. <laughs> when you leave the preview, they give you a Beauty and the Beast bookmark. Something that uh, you can take home with you. Wait a second. I see a bell. I have to stop every time I see a bell. All right, let's continue. Everybody on this channel is so excited. Hello, Shane. Hi, Shane. Where are you <laughs> Who said that? Hello. 